The Attorney General's office is asking the state Supreme Court to set an execution for a Callaway County man. Brian Dorsey is on death row for killing his family members, Sarah and Ben Bonney, in 2006. The U.S. Supreme Court today paved the way for the state to go forward with Dorsey's death. Law enforcement in Callaway County spent Christmas Eve in 2006 investigating a murder. You got two actually families here since they've been married, been married a couple of months. They have, and yes, it, they're close knit. Uh, they're devastated. The family of Sarah and Ben Bonney found them dead in their new Bloomfield home that morning. Friends of Sarah Bonney's told our reporters at the time how much she cared for her husband and daughter Jade. Her whole life was Jade. Um, well, I mean, her husband Ben too, but. But Jade was her life. Uh, it's always Ben and Jade, Ben and Jade. So I know right now she would want us to just focus on Jade. On December 26, the Bonnie's cousin, Brian Dorsey, would turn himself in and admit to the killings. Law enforcement also said Sarah Bonnie had been sexually assaulted. Investigators say Dorsey shot the couple over a drug debt he owed. Dorsey was in the throes of addiction at the time and was asking his family for money to help pay that debt. He pleaded guilty in 2008 to the killings, but argued for a life sentence. A jury sentenced him to die. That kicked off years of appeals and claims his attorneys never properly investigated his case or any factors that might have made a jury instead choose life in prison. Today, the U.S. Supreme Court rejected the latest effort. The justices won't hear a case that Dorsey's attorneys never brought up how well he had adjusted to incarceration, seen as a factor to argue against the death penalty. Attorney General Andrew Bailey says if the court approves his request, Dorsey's execution would take place within 90 to 120 days.